midnight where things are heating up. And now it's time for our elimination round. The panelists with the lowest score at the end of this game must go home or at least go stand over there for a second. <laughs> There's nothing creators on TikTok love more than taking a perfectly normal food dish and then just straight up adding a full slice of American cheese. <laughs> for example, this video. I'm not so much lactose intolerant as I am that intolerant. You know? So for tonight's elimination game, we're playing the quite literal, how long until they put a full slice of American cheese in it? <laughs> I'm going to show you the opening still of a TikTok cooking video, and you'll have to guess how many seconds it takes for them to put a full slice of American cheese in there. <laughs> and now, here is the still. Panelists, how many seconds until they put a full slice of American cheese in this dish? Dish is a strong word. <laughs> All right, panelists, think about how many seconds until they put a slice of American cheese in there. Think carefully because you're going to wager your points on this. That's where we let you think about it. when you want to lock in your answers. <laughs> Everybody's locked in. Okay, Mark, how long did you think it would take and why? Well, I I'm going to go with um, 11 seconds. Oh, okay, okay, all right. Solid, solid guess. Brendan, what's your guess and why? One. One. Now, Zainab, how many seconds will it take and why? Um, I actually thought three. Three? Wow. Okay. All right. Okay. We got one second, 11 seconds, three seconds. All right, let's see the answer. did you wager? Four. Four points? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, that was the best. <laughs> Zainab, how much did you wager? I did it all. Oh. I'm an all or nothing type of girl. And Brendan, how much did you wager? I also did it all. Oh! Somehow there is a tie, which is illegal. <laughs> Mark, you are going to the finals. Yeah. But to break this tie between Zainab and Brendan, please share your hottest goss. Depending on what it is, it may be bleeped for broadcast. The hottest goss determined by the audience will win. Zainab? Mark didn't tell you guys the real story. Oh! <laughs> what? <laughs> he did not hurt his foot doing step ups <laughs> at the gym. How did I do it? <laughs> He had a podcast guest on. Mm. And this podcast guest is notorious for licking toes. Oh. And they bit his toe. Oh. You know, Bobby Lee is weird. <laughs> it's pretty good. It's pretty good. <laughs> Brendan, what's your hot goss? Well, um, it was funny that earlier you mentioned uh, Peppa Pig. Um, <laughs> I, you know, as the uh, father of a three-year-old, I watch a lot of Peppa Pig and a lot of Paw Patrol. And I happen to know for a fact 
Peppa Pig the Paw Patrol. Oh my God. Well. Wow. All right, audience, you're gonna vote. Clap if you want Zainab to win. And clap if you want Brendan to win. Looks like Brendan is our winner. That means Zainab is unfortunately eliminated. Aww. Before you go, Zainab, we want you to announce your inevitable career pivot since this fake comedy game show stuff doesn't seem to be your strength. <laughs> Yeah, it sucks, Taylor. Um, well, <laughs> since I clearly can't make it as a guest on After Midnight, I will be pivoting to host of After Midnight. <laughs> <laughs> Tomorrow night, everyone, check out After Midnight with Zaynab Johnson on CBS. <laughs> and with that, we bid you adieu. Good luck in your next career at Sounds Fruitful. Take care. Two finalists remain, and one will be crowned the victor. It's time for For the Win. <laughs> Over the weekend, this clip posted by New Vision Cat Club went viral, and it's easy to see why. This young lady is just simply all that Anna Baggish is. She is the perfection of geometric balance. No longer than tall to make a square with a breadth of body that makes a cube. Look at that body. It's as broad as it is tall as it is long. Heavy bones. And what you want with her, she's not mine. What I wouldn't give to be a perfect cube. <laughs> as broad as I am tall as I am long. <laughs> so panelists, for the win, I want you to write a review of After Midnight as eloquently as this fancy cat judge. <laughs> After the break, we'll hear your answers and our studio audience will pick a winner. We'll be right back on After Midnight. <laughs> 